girls 11 12 200 yard freestyle finals heat in lane one at the bottom of your screen is taylor newton irvine nova lane two mallory hahn piedmont lane three mckenna meyer reno aquatic lane four sophia sarukian edmonton lane five courtney mckainan Irvine, lane six, Natalie Ward, Tucson Ford, lane seven, Chinoa Devine Davis, and in lane eight, Tegan McGinnis, Tucson Ford Dealers. Early leader in lane number four, that is Sophia Sorokian. Sorokian out in 26, 85 at the 50, showing the early speed, but she's got some company. Right above her in lane number five, that's Courtney McKinnon, and in lane number three, right below her, McKenna Meyer. All these girls right in there with the leader as we come up on the halfway mark here. This is probably the closest race we've seen so far in these 200 freestyles. Only about an arm's length lead Sophia has in lane four. 54.99 for her first 100. 55.5 right behind her. But all the ladies were pretty close this morning. 155.3 for Sophia, 155.9. One of the swimmers who's made the journey all the way from uh, our neighbors to the north, the Edmonton team, just kind of showing you some of the reach that this Far Western Championships has. People from all over the world coming to be a part of these Far Western Championships. Like I said at the beginning of this broadcast, it is a legendary meet. It's been around for decades. And people apparently all the way up north in Canada recognize that this is a great place to get some good competition. What a great back half Sophia just had here in this 200. It was very close at the 100, and she's over a body length lead, and she is going to be your 11 and 12 champion this year. Woo! 153 13. In second place, lane number three, Meyer with a 155 97. And third place, lane six, 156 46. 153 13. And that's another record.